Since 1886, the self-denial appeal has impacted hundreds of thousands of lives around the world. So during this time each year, we have an incredible opportunity to prayerfully consider what we can deny ourselves of to further the mission of the Worldwide Salvation Army. Our loving God knows our heart, our innermost thoughts. We turn to God's Word in this series to focus on a gift from the heart. What we give, whether it be large or small, may only be seen by our Heavenly Father. We're reminded in the Word to give cheerfully and generously with what we have. We are such a blessed people. We want you to prayerfully reflect on what gift from your heart you can offer, from whatever blessings you've received from God, large or small. As the Apostle Paul points out, when the willingness is there, the gift is acceptable. The Self-Denial series will highlight the incredible work of the Salvation Army in two territories. In Kenya West Territory, we will see how the Salvation Army is meeting the physical needs of communities through the ACE program, Teaching Sustainable Agriculture. We'll also hear about the Worth Project, which has helped thousands of women transform their futures through business development groups. In Papua New Guinea and Solomon Islands Territory, a place very dear to my heart, we'll learn how Coram remote villages are not only preaching the gospel, but also holding literacy classes We'll also see the wonderful story of the Lay Street School, where children receive an education and get back into mainstream schooling. These stories are just a few examples of how self-denial funds are transforming communities around the world by sharing the gospel and meeting human need. We want to thank you for your ongoing support to this appeal. Last year, we raised over $3.2 million, which has been distributed to hundreds of core and projects by international headquarters in countries that need it most. It is incredible to think that every Salvation Army Territory contributes to the self-denial appeal in their own way, all giving sacrificially to share the gospel and to meet human need. I've seen myself while worshipping in my core in Papua New Guinea, the widow who literally brought her might. It's taken so seriously. They want to invest in people who are poorer than they are. I've seen the women in the highlands dancing and bringing their billums full of their first fruits so that they might give to those who are poorer than them. Deeply moving experiences. This year includes something special a song written by the cadets in the Kenya West Territory. They praise God with the words, we shall sing all praise to God the Father. He has done wonders to all. We've brought our self-denial gifts. We have brought all with cheerful hearts. I'm absolutely committed to the aim of giving one week's salary on missionary service. I encourage you to do the same. I've seen personally what a difference it makes. So together, Let's worship our great God with an eagerness to give a gift from the heart this self-denial season. Thank you and may God bless you.